Nah, real talk. Thanks. Uh, what do you think? When what do you think? Uh, more. What do you think humans were actually created for? Like, what what is like the sole purpose of us really being here, other than just working most of our lives? I think every person within the human life has their own individual purpose. Like, that's what I believe. I don't believe everybody's sent here for the same reason. Like, I feel like everybody has a different purpose. And sometimes your purpose can be something so small and mediocre. Like, it's some people that that was designed to fucking play sports. Like, they just have the genetics to play sports. Their body is made for sports. They're athletic. Like, they're just designed for that. Then you got some people that was born with vocal cords and they're designed to sing. Not everybody was born with vocal cords to sing. So you got some people that was like, everybody's just different. You got some people that was designed to be fucking a lawyer. Some people that was designed to be like, everybody, I feel like has a different purpose within this world. And I feel like, um, I feel like our duty is to not just be here living, but to find that purpose. Because once you find that purpose, it makes life easier. Life is only hard when you don't know your direction or what you're, what you're doing. That's when it becomes hard and that's when it becomes shitty because you don't know why you're here. You're just going to work every day. You, you don't have no excitement. But once you find your purpose, you know what you need to be doing. You know, like everything is, it's like a guide almost. It's like a fucking map to life. Facts. Facts. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like a lot of us, I feel like we're meant, I feel like all, like all of us are meant to be creative. I feel like we're all meant to be, you know, just, just creative, man, and talented, man. Like, it's like a lot of people. That feel like the, I feel like a lot of people forget that. I feel like we can do way more than just work all our lives. You know what I'm saying? People work their life away, and they have regrets. Then I should have done this more. I should have done that more. You know what I'm saying? It's like when you sit back. When I sit back and analyze, right? <laughs> when I sit back and analyze, constantly, kind of that nigga created the word "riz," my nigga. You got you look at X X X the time show. The nigga created a word called get you, nigga. Do you know how creative we are, my nigga? Just just by using your imagination, nigga, you are very creative. You can be very creative. Make that shit into reality. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And you see all these words evolving. It's just different words. Same meaning. It might be the same meaning or a different meaning. It's like a lot of words evolve that we're able to create things over time. It's crazy. Yeah, it's super crazy. And it, it kind of goes back to what I was saying in our last interview when I was saying like how we as human beings are the only life species that keeps evolving over time. No other species evolves more than the human. Like we are going to constantly evolve over and over and over and over. Yeah, that Because our because our creativity, you know, our brain capacity and things of that nature. You know, oh. I kind of feel like the creativity go out the door when you start getting older, you start having responsibilities. Like, that's why I tell people all the time, it's important to keep your inner child. Like that inner child, like you, you only recall, like, you know how, like when you young and you're a kid, you got all these creativities, you create and stuff, you draw and you doing all, like, I remember when I was a kid, when we didn't have certain shit or we couldn't afford certain stuff, we used to make it ourselves. Like I used to play with WWE action figures and shit growing up. And I didn't have enough money to buy like the ring. Like, I don't know if you remember, but they used to have rings where you can buy the rings and play the action mm -hmm. figures in the ring. We didn't have enough money to buy that type of shit. So we would make our own motherfucking ring and put like pencil sticks on the corner and mm -hmm. like tie a rope around. Like just stuff like that be making me think like we were so creative as kids when we didn't have shit. But, but we would make our we would make ways to make certain stuff. And I feel like when you become an adult, a lot of people lose that creativity because of responsibilities and stuff like that. But that's what gets you to the next level, having that creativity and that, that imagination. Facts. I feel, like, I feel like a lot of people tend to forget about that to just don't take life too serious. Because like a lot of people just get caught up in the loop and just taking life serious. You got to live in the present moment. You may not have the house. You, might, you might not have the house you want or you know apartment you want. You gotta live in the present moment and just have fun and enjoy your life at a young age. That's why I'm asking what I'm doing now. I'm kind of enjoying myself right now. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people still stuck on 
the money shit. You know, worry about their bank account. Worry about like how much money they got in their bank. Like, bro, niggas gotta understand that shit is not real. <laughs> money is not real. This shit is fake. It's all it's an fake. illusion. It's all it's and it's real. all put in place to keep people enslaved. That's the exactly, whole purpose man. of it. That's crazy you said. Like, that. Got, like if you, it's like it's like a lot of like this world take life so serious, bro. To the point, like, damn, you you drain your own, all your energy and, and chasing money. No, nigga, you gotta like really chase love too, like spread love, man. I feel like that's what we need way more than we're just loving. Passion and purpose. Yeah, man. Like, I feel like love is way more important than money. Way yeah. more. You don't have enough. It's just money. Is a, I feel like money is the cause of the way this world is now. Exactly. Money, money is, is one of those things. It. It's put in place to keep people controlled and keep people a slave because society that made it out to where now, if you don't have money, if you don't have material, if you don't have all those things, then you're behind. That's the reason why the average motherfucker is, is stressing out. If you really look around America right now, nobody is really dealing with, like it's some people that's dealing with real problems, but majority of America and the majority of the people that's around the world that's quote unquote dealing with real problems, they're only dealing with real problems because it's financial shit. Most of our problems come from money. Yep. You ever understand that? Like, if you were, if you just was to remove money away from the equation, most people would be happy as fuck. No, nobody really have real problems outside of them having to pay rent. They car note due. They bills due. Like, they got their kids got to eat. Like, everything always stems from money. Mm -hmm. And I feel like if you're going. If you're living life just chasing money and not chasing passion and purpose, then you're never going to be fulfilled. You're never going to be fulfilled. Even if you have a shit ton of money. Like, once you get that money, you're still going to be searching for more yeah. money. You're never going to be satisfied chasing money. Yep. That's why you got to chase yep. passion and purpose. Like, what you're doing right now with this YouTube shit. Like, you're doing this shit because you genuinely like doing YouTube. I love it, you're man. You're not on here it. trying to... And that's why you're going to grow over time. Eventually, you're going to see your platform grow crazy because you're not one of those YouTubers that's out here chasing views and chasing money. You're just doing it because you enjoy doing it. Exactly. And that's how I was when I started. That's the only reason I grew on this shit. Facts. True to the people.